Hello guys, and welcome back to Tales of Monkey Island Chapter 2 uh, The Siege of Spinner K Oh god, fishing well again? Are you kidding me? I don't want to do this again More Bakelian ruins This looks like some kind of old furnace Or maybe a barbecue? A barbecue I think it's a Vakalian barbecue. A barbecue. Guybrush, seriously. That won't do anything. It's not even on. Let's not do anything with it, because I can't do anything with it. What? Let's not do anything with a thing, because we can't do anything with it. I'm sure there's logic somewhere around there, but I'm not entirely sure. Okay. Has almost grown feet. LeChuck! Guybrush! Oh, thank goodness you're safe! What? Elaine and I were so worried. Forget it, LeChuck. You may have somehow fooled my wife with your voodoo trickery, but not me. But it's true! Thanks to you, I'm a new man. Completely voodoo free. And I have good news, Guybrush. I have found one of the Mer people summoning artifacts. I just need a little help actually getting it. What's your game, LeChuck? Lure me into a false sense of security with kind words and sandwiches and then murder me in my sleep? My boy, if I wanted to murder you, I'd just throw you off this cliff. Why wait for you to sleep? How reassuring. I completely trust you now. Great. I don't. We'll put the past in the past and agree to work together for a change. Uh-huh. A coupon. Rebate. <gasps> Large oysters. Tasty. For the fish, I mean. I try not to eat bait anymore. Yeah, but you should bait. I have missed. I've missed so many references because I haven't. Hmm. It looks like it opens somehow. I wonder if there's anything inside. No dice. There must be some trick to opening it. Oh. Oh. I have. I have familiar clamps. I know. This looks familiar. I believe this thing might have something to do with opening the altar. I just need to figure it out. Um. I know already. So. Guybrush, please stop. I'm trying to figure this thing out. But all you have to do is... No, 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 no. I can figure it out on my own. Suit yourself. I'm treasure chest. Can I just... You know I can see you reaching for our chest. Give I'm staring back. right at it. Sorry. Oh, God. Well, let's go back to the... other place. Yorkbait Islands, get the book, and get the fishy fish from the coupon. Or the coupon fishy fish. You know what I mean, I hope. Oh good, we're saving the game. Oh, y'all are good. Hello, Tetra. Hello. Hello, Sailor. Hello. Hello, Tetra. You know, I would... I knew you... Uh, 101 fish jokes. 101 fish jokes. 101 fish jokes? Really? My ancestors have worked for centuries to gather these treasures of knowledge and preserve them within these walls so that our race will long be respected for our intellectual achievements. <laughs> and you want fish jokes? Yes. Yep. <sighs> Fine. Here, this ought to enrich your understanding of Vakalian literature. Great. Hope it doesn't keep me in stitches or I might need a sturgeon. Oh my god. I hate you now. Sorry. We should probably check the book though. 101 fish jokes. Hey, there's a coupon in here. I wonder if it's still good. <laughs> Why did a fish need an aspirin? <laughs> he had a haddock. <laughs> oh dear god. It's so bad, it was almost hilarious. Oh god. Fresh bait! Can I take the bucket? Hey, can I have this bucket? Well, I like you, so yeah, go ahead. What are you gonna use it for? I don't know. So, why do you want to take it? Um, because it's there, I guess? You're a weird, kid. <laughs> Cute, but weird. Thank you. Because it's there. I mean... Hi, um, a numbly? Hello again, sailor. Please stop saying that. What'll it be? Um... How did I want to know that. How do you repair my ship? How do you repair my ship so fast? I'm telling you, mouse replacement is easy. There are a whole slew of trees out there on Spoon Isle Beach just perfect for mouse. 
Not to mention the fact that they are just sitting by the water's edge where I can easily grab one. I just float one over to your ship, a flip, a flop, and it's done. These trees on Spoon Isle, can anyone just take one? Technically, sure, but they're pretty heavy. I'd suggest leaving it to the experts. Right. So you sell bait and repair ships here. That's an odd pairing. Well, times are tough. Sometimes you gotta pick up an extra job or two just to earn enough sand dollars to live on. That's tough. You think that's bad? And this place used to be a bait shop oh, and pizza joint. And I still couldn't sell any anchovies. I'd like some bait, please. Sure. You got your coupon? Yes, I do. Great, hand it over. Uh, here you go, Emily. I've got a coupon here for something called Gusanos de Destino. Wow, that's an old coupon. I'm not even sure I still carry this stuff. Oh, I clicked. Sorry. I found some. It was all the way in the back behind the monkey fingers. It's even still glowing. Ew. Ew. That's kind of creepy, actually. Oysters. I want oysters, please. I'd like some oysters, please. Oh, you're lucky. We only have one left, and it's a doozy. You know, some people refer to the oyster as the love muscle. Really? Maybe that's just to boost its self-esteem. This thing's as ugly as a pile of seagull droppings. Oh my god. You're hilarious. So, what should we do? Because I'm not entirely sure. Probably get back to the shock, I suppose? Hey guys, I'm back! Oh goody! Maybe there's a fair way to determine who gets to bury the artifact. Yeah, maybe. Oh yeah? Well, what do you suggest? Um, staring contest? How about a staring contest? First one to blink loses. Hey, I like that idea. Yeah, it's so simple. Would you please tell that lady behind you to button up her blouse? Where? Where? Nice chest. But it looks a little empty. There's nothing there! Sorry, yeah. it was probably just a weather balloon. A weather balloon, yeah. Oh! Ooh, hey you guys, I'm back! This is good. Oh. And we're gonna... Bon voyage! Did you say something? Not me. Maybe it was Captain McGillicuddy. Neptune's beard! If he sees we haven't buried this chest yet, he might just bury us instead! Come on, come on, we've got to go now! Yeah, that might be a good idea. They're not even checking if they're... Mark, it's me, Skyward Street Boy, Mighty Pirate. Hilarious. That was fucking hilarious. Well, that's that. Done <laughs> and buried! <laughs> okay, we should hand into the young girl, I suppose. I don't know why, but we should. I am watching or reading from a walkthrough. Because I suck at this. And I can never fucking figure things out. So. A fishing. Oh, coupon. C coupon. Coupon. Free bait. Good for one order of fish eggs. Coupon valid at most participating jerkbait island locations. Neat. Should we combine the hook and the. I read somewhere I should combine these, I don't know why, but... Okay, come on, little fishy. Hey, I think I feel a nibble. Can you feel a nibble? Come a little closer... Gotcha! Uh-oh. Oh, for fuck's sake, guy brush. Guybrush Threepwood, obtainer of cranky golden fish artifacts. Whew. Holy shit, you're awesome, Guybrush. Since we have another coupon, I might as well use that one here. I'd like some bait, please. Fish eggs. Sure, here you go. Thanks. Ugh. No problem. I just made them myself. Oh god. You didn't Oh what? god. <laughs> Relax. I'm just yanking your tail. You're adorable when you squirm. Thank you. Onward to Brillig Island. Aye aye, sir. 
I'm guessing we need to explore all of these places. Wow, I didn't think tiny islands like this actually existed. Good thing I'm not stuck here. I haven't finished my top five things to have while stranded on a deserted island list. Ah, it's me, Skyward Freakboy, Whitey Pirate. Oh shit. If I were a buried parrot, where would I be? Buried. Even as small as these islands are, I wouldn't want to just dig randomly in the hopes of finding buried treasure. I'd be island hopping for years. Coconut. As funny as it would be, I'd hate for someone to trip on this coconut and get hurt. I should probably get rid of it. Ow. You know, on second thought, maybe I'll just leave it there. Yeah. I can't just dig randomly. Well, say something then. Ah, it's me, Skyward Freakboy, Whitey Pirate. Aha, there you are, little parrot. I'll have you dug up in a second. Ah, it's me, Skyward Freakboy, Whitey Pirate. Creepy. It sounds like I've been buried <laughs> alive. Again. And I think once is enough for a lifetime. Yeah, I agree. Two is a bit. Uh, three, definitely enough. Take that, Poxy Pirates! Never underestimate the treasure-finding skills of Guybrush Street. Ah, it's me, Guybrush Street Boy, Whitey Pirate. Oh, shut up already! You're taking the pirate with you, I suppose. Hi, crab. <laughs> Cute. Now what? Uh oh, is that flotsam? Ah, no, no. Ah, ma petite maîtresse. Where is the puny pirate and his superbly sickly hand? Right here. Oh, and what a glorious battle it was. Guybrush was amazing. You should have seen the way he... What? No, 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 no. This will not do. I need all of Monsieur Sripwood. That was not our agreement. I think you'd better give me my gold now. Oui, oui, of course. Ah, but I have discovered that Sweepwood himself is very special. I need his body for my experiment. I'll pay you double to bring him back to me alive. Make it triple. I'll make it quadruple. Once I have extracted his essence and perfected my elixir, the world will offer me all of the treasures in exchange. Now go, mademoiselle. Go like the winds of Flotsam and bring me my perfectly profitable pirate prize. You weird. Weird and extremely scary. <laughs> I'm gonna end it now, so I'll see you in the next episode of Derrida's I Make. Bye for now.